Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hey guys, welcome. So time for another episode of X-Men 97 and today we're checking out episode 9 and this one is called Tolerance is Extinction Part 2. So last week was amazing. Bastion's ultimate plan was to turn everyday citizens into sentinels and once activated they immediately transformed and started tracking down and attacking the mutants. We had so many great scenes in that. Spider-Man turned up for a moment, Wolverine and Nightcrawler took on a bunch of uh, mentimals? Is that just a word I made up? <laughs> mentimals but ultimately at the end of the episode magneto escaped and he floated up into the atmosphere and said enough and let out a massive electromagnetic pulse i'm assuming which kind of just killed electronics all around the world and now shit i don't know what's going to go on now bastion appears to be defeated i thought he was going to be the big bad for a little while but Mag magneto kind of stepped up and um laid, laid down the gauntlet and declared war so without further ado let's go Hey guys, so check out my Patreon link down below with all my socials, so come say hi, don't forget like, and subscribe. This show has been exceptional from the get-go. Every episode is just amazing. Our empire shall welcome a new emperor, Professor Charles Xavier. Emperor Charles. My god. His name's Bastion. He used the fallout from Genosha to get backing for his Prime Sentinel program. Prime Sentinels. I like Mentinels. Has a ring to it. He's, he's a sentinel, given human form. Do you understand the futility of fighting the future? A yeah, human sentinel. Was right. Right. Nito has blacked out the earth. Where's the professor when you need him? To me, oh. my X-Men. He turned up at the very end, that's right. So Magneto's blacked out the entire earth. Charles is back. Storm's gonna turn up. Yeah, boy. It's gonna be a long wait for the next season i mean watching this series every week has been amazing and apparently storm's black costume is her original outfit i've just been reading the original books so i i think i've recognized that as 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 the thing i'm just still soaking my brains in everything x-men right now i'm almost gonna turn mutant you watch <laughs> oh holy shit man all right let's go Spoiler free once again. I love going in not knowing. I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm seeing people freaking out on, on Twitter, but n nothing spoiled. But yeah, it's, it's really a really good time. It's a great vibe. So Charles is back at the mansion. Magneto, pull the power move. That's right, Bastion turned his own mum. There's no power anywhere, and people are freaking out. Oh, he's all charm? It's all fucked up. Oh shit, here she comes. Hello there. So much destruction. All this happened while he was away. Holy shit, is he raising a mountain? Using all the metals in the earth? So powerful. Wow. Forge has got jet boots. <laughs> Sick. She's back. Full powered. To finally be together. To have a family. A child like Nathan. The choice should have been ours. Whoops, sorry. Perhaps that was a mistake. Because just like you... I'm right back here. Back at the mansion. Square one. Doing what they do. And Scott is angry. And hurt. No matter what they do, nothing changes. Remy. I... No! No, oh, she was dreaming about no. him. How do you feel? Surely you could have just walked to three feet. Much has happened, Fräulein. Trask survived. And so did... Remy? No. Oh, shucks. We missed the whole down. You sure did. Your powers restored thanks to Forge. Please. Aurora's doing her modest goddess routine. It's been too long, my friend. Modest goddess. <laughs> Your augmented prosthetics remain functional despite Magneto's blackout. This whole thing. 
Bring together an electrostatic deflector ages ago. Handy. Oh, my friend. Thought about it? Oh, gee. Thought about it? Made it. Without warning, Magneto's thrown the entire planet back centuries. I can feel the Earth's magnetic field dying even now. Wow, dying. Sunsets tonight. It sets on the future. Holy shit, he's fucked the whole planet. We need to find Magneto and convince him to reverse the damage to Earth before it becomes permanent. How does he reverse it? The boy could communicate with machines. Cerebro had detected him, so I assumed he was a mutant. Assumed he was a His mutant. slammed the door when she heard the word. He wasn't a mutant. I believe Magnus will be open to turning the power back on. Well, didn't you also believe it was a good idea to hand the bad guy your school? That's enough. <laughs> oh dear. The world ends in less than 12 hours. Kurt will teleport us to Muir Island. Let's get to work, team. 12 hours. The clock is ticking. Charles described Bastion as a technopath, which is essentially telepathy for machines. Technopath. If Bastion's abilities operate like our mutations, we can use neutralizer technology to permanently disable his control of prime... Right, good plan. Except... He was always trying to outrun his past with the Thieves' Guild. Remy was the most Cajun man I ever met. He was part of the as Thieves' Guild? That's awesome. Maybe if you saw us as people and not students, you'd have realized Oh that. man, everyone's bit um. Oh, holy shit. What the heck? It's just dropping mountains of iron? What an entrance. I am not the one who needs to be reasoned with, Charles. There is a large asteroid hovering over my home that begs otherwise. <laughs> oh, holy shit. When you abandoned us for your Shia bird queen, you bequeathed it to me. Ask me to walk your path. Are you prepared to walk mine? Oh my god. The path leads to total destruction for both humans and mutants. You must undo the damage you've done. Will humanity undo Genosha? Oh shit, man. Oh no. I promised a boy a future free of fear, only to watch his frightened eyes be vaporized inside his tiny skull. Oh, holy shit. Paul H. A new Genosha. We have gotten here by walking this man's path. Oh, he's making so much sense. That's the scary thing. Cling to this dying world. Or rise to your future and look down upon this fallen pigsty planet. Pigsty planet? We are not gods, Magnus. Yes, we are. And in those who believe in them. Mutants do not. Wow, holy Decide shit. My X-Men. Oh, my X-Men. No. In Genosha, I made a choice to lead our kind to a new age. Yeah. You were gone, gal. None of you were there the day Genosha fell. Who dies next, Professor? Jean? <laughs> Been there, done that. Wow, holy shit. Jubilee? Roberto? I will not see any more mutants die. Yep. Joining the dark side. The offer was made. The door is open. See that his point has been made. It's so easy to kind of succumb to the hate and the anger and join him, especially when you've lost people that you love. And son, let me guess. Be careful. No. Give him hell. Give him hell. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Almost forgot. <laughs> Am I going to war or a circus? What'd you expect? Black leather? Were you expecting yellow spandex? <laughs> Classic. Civilization as we know it ends. Much like in the past, my X-Men and I are your best hope to avoid that future. Old school suit up. Let's go. We have been here before, President Kelly. If you don't trust me, trust my X-Men. This is so cool, man. Marvel Girl. <laughs> nice. Loving the callbacks. Oh shit, he's charging up. Open the silo. What is this? Oh, what the hell? 
Sentinels. Wow. We're under attack. Again. Shouldn't Magneto's blackout have shut these things down? Yeah, what the hell, man? Bastion must be power in their circuitry using his technopathy. God damn it. Oh. <laughs> oh. Not in a dream or our gifts, but in each other. Yeah, guys still. Mind your weather, sister. And them weather your mind. Oh, I'm loving her in this so much. Dom is amazing, and the voice actress is doing such a great job. I mean, look at her. Look, look what she's doing. Holy shit. Epic. Wow. They wanted into Fallout. Unfortunately, you'll have no one to share it with. Try as you might, x -Men. You cannot stop me and my kind. Oh, he's one one hive mind. Did he just turn into the Hulk? Morph smash! Nice morph smash. <laughs> so good. I love how they can use morph to bring in these other characters. The occasional Avenger, Spidey, loving the cameos. The question, what is the sound of one hand clapping? <laughs> Slap. I waited for this moment. I know oh. you're Sinister. Your strengths, weaknesses. Ooh, dirty fighting. Do you reckon we're gonna get a live action adaption of Mr. Sinister? That would be so cool. A live action adaption faithful to the comics would be amazing. And I hope that the MCU does it. Like costume accurate, character accurate. There's so much potential to do it right. I mean, it's right here. If you ask nicely, I can tell you when I switched you. Oh shit. It doesn't matter. Madeline fights with me today. When were they swapped out? How long has she been Madeline? Strike! Oh! That would hurt, man. Those things are heavy. Chosen your side. Oh, good. We're skipping the blabber. <laughs> Go, Wolvie. Oh, my God. He looks so awesome. Time out, sugar. You're playing to kill. I hate that Rogue's gone to the dark side. Hey, I'm, I'm sorry, Juice. You okay? Yep, I'm fine. Friend versus friend. I said sorry. We're on opposite night. We're on opposite sides now, man. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, how I've waited to say these two words to you, old friend. Oh. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> he does waffle on a bit, <laughs> old Charles. <laughs> Bastion, Xavier's brats have breached the base. We must retreat. Oh no. There's no retreat. Ugh. That was Morph. Holy shit. A snake like Sinister would never risk his life for another. No, your role. Ugh. God damn. Wow. So cool. Yahoo! Oh, shit. Oh, they're both fallen. I'm shocked that such a coward hasn't abandoned Bastion yet. I was waiting for you to bring me what I want. <laughs> What I want? What? What? Look who's here, my rising thing of chance. Hey, boom. My real mother was a world class telekinetic, just like you. Oh, shit. That tends not to skip a generation. Oh, wait, what? He's telekinetic? Wow. Holy dooly. Is that a thing? I don't know much about Cable, I don't know. 
Jeez. Oh no, wait. They didn't kill her again, did they? Ugh. The helmet's off. You've left me no choice, Magnus. Oh, holy shit. This show brings the goods, man. God damn, the storytelling is just excellent. Wow, we done it again. Another pulse. Oh, that's one way of doing it. Oh, Charles, now you have finally found the metal to do what is necessary. You are a traitor to your race. Oh, jeez. What? Oh, holy shit. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Man, what? 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 <sighs> Oh my god. What? Was he stripping the adamantium from his bones? Is that what he was doing? Holy shit, I need to look at that image again. Every week, this show escalates. Good lord, it is fucking phenomenal. I got chills every app. They have knocked this out of the absolute park. God damn. God damn. And only one episode to go. Wait, that scene with Wolverine at the end was come from a comic? Okay, I'm just reading some some um, threads. Oh, from it's from a book. It's from a book, which I'm reading. Hopefully I'm not too spoiled. But shit. And is Jean okay? Goddamn. Goddamn. Yeah, so I had a closer look at the image and uh, it looks like, yeah, all the metal is coming off his bones, being controlled by Magneto, so... Holy shit, moving forward. I know that um, Wolverine didn't start his life with the adamantium skeleton. He used to have the, the bone claws. But taking them off him now, reverting back to that situation where he's not going to be as invulnerable as he is. Still having um, the, the healing factor on, but it's definitely going to change the game. I mean, holy shit, that was a climactic ending and there's only one episode to go. Cable versus Gene. That felt like a goodbye. Is Cable going to kill Jean? I know Jean's died a, a couple of times with the, the Phoenix Saga. Multiple times. I'm not too clued up on, on how many times she's died. She might survive her. I don't know. But it's feeling pretty dire right now. I mean, shit. The storytelling. Good lord. It is so good. Season 2 and Season 3 are coming. And I think they're going to rush release them. So we don't have to wait too long between seasons. But I can imagine it would be at least a year right i mean i don't expect to see another season this year it would be great but at the same time you don't want to saturate yourself and have too much of a good thing all right i mean what we're getting right now is sensational i'd quite happily wait another year for the next part but as long as they maintain the quality like i said the writing is just so good and it's exciting and it just woo, every app is just, <laughs> it's just so good i know i'm waffling on i just i can't get over how amazing this show is Anyway, guys, I'm done. Please uh, comment down below. Don't forget like and subscribe. Catch you next time. Thanks for watching.